Why do you have a glove on? Just one. I always just have one glove on. You always have one glove on? I do. Fair enough. On December 2nd, 2022, police were dispatched to a jewelry store in reference to a robbery in progress. What happened? Me, me open the door. What, what, what happened? Okay. Let me explain. Um, so I usually keep the door um, locked. Uh -huh. And that girl in the black, uh, red leggings came like okay. around, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes ago. What she look like? Black? She's white? white. Okay. So she seemed, because I don't usually open the door if they look creepy. Okay. But I did notice um, a truck parked there for like five minutes. Uh huh. Which I kept checking my cameras on, like that seems so suspicious, you know? Mm -hmm. But I didn't see no one getting out or anything, and I just seen that lady come from the opposite. So I get up, open the door, and right after she walked in, three guys came. Three? Uh huh. White guys? The first one, see, I, I could just see their eyes because they were all covered. Okay. Um, and they were all just wearing black, and I could just see the first one, and he seemed like about five, five, not too tall. And I really feel seeing. Like and Asian, did they all get in the same next, car? Yeah, in the truck. All of them? Even the lady? No, that, I don't know how the lady, I don't know if she left right away. I didn't. So did the lady do anything? She just made me open the door. And right after she came, they came. So I'm pretty did, sure... You felt that she was with them? Yeah. Okay, Cause why so would, what, what happened after she, she you opened the door? Um, the three guys came. So I opened the door. And then where did she go? And then I kind of knew it was kind of sus. So I just make her walk all the way over here. Uh -huh. And then I usually do not go over there for the customers. But I was just like, what are you looking for? What, what's, what, 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 how old is this lady? Like in her 20s. White female 20s? Yeah. And then uh, I'm like, why are you looking close, for? Close, real quick, because I'm, I'm putting it out. Oh, the um, she's wearing red leggings. And what about white, that? White top and a black sweater. White top, black sweater, Long red hair. leggings, blonde hair. Okay, so. And I also had my phone for the same reason, ready to call like, just in case. And the guy took my phone. They made me go in the corner. I didn't see anything. I just saw. There was three males. Three males. And then what happened when, when the guys came in? Oh, they um, straight went into the cold. Okay, they cracked stuff. Mm -hmm. Did they, they assault you at all? No. Okay. Um, so. But they kept telling me, "Don't turn around, don't turn." And I see, I feel like some. They had um, guns with them. Did, did, they kept, push, did they push you? Um, no. But the guy did tell me, okay, go away, go away. Go to a corner. And he kept pointing uh, like inside his sweater. Like if you something or... Okay. And then the guys came in and then she left? Yeah. While they were still in here? I believe she did. Okay. But the fourth car up, that one backing out. Hey, go. Uh, huh? Go. Go? Yeah. 24. I'm going to stop Charles Frank John 6249 real quick. Sounds like this possibly associated, but they didn't give us that good of intel. Hello. Turn the car off real quick for me. Yeah, this matches, but she's by herself. Can you take the keys out of the ignition for me? Yes. Understand you're being audio and visually recorded, okay? Uh huh. Were you just over at the jewelry store? Yes, I was. Okay. What were you doing over there? I was looking for a Christmas present for my mother. Okay. Step out of the car real quick. You want to walk to the back? Twenty four. Just a remission. We did it. The RP advised that all three males left in the truck, but left the female. Okay, we're with the female now. She says she was at the jewelry store. Uh, we're just waiting to hear back from one four two to find out what her involvement was. Have it at twenty three. At this point, it's unclear if she was involved. She may 
have just been a bystander or she could have been a decoy. Okay, we'll identify her and we'll talk to her a little bit about what's going on, but unless you get some more intel, we'll go from there. Hey, do you have ID with you? Or is it in the car? Is the car registered to you? Yes, please. Okay. What's your full name? Juliana. Okay. Well, I'm advise you of your rights here in just a second, okay? okay? Understand that right now we just responded to a robbery. Obviously, there was something going on at the jewelry store where you were at. All right, hang on a second. Right now, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say is against you in the court of law. You have the right time to talk to a lawyer. Have a present with him. I've been questioned. If you can't afford to hire a lawyer. One will be appointed to represent for any question if you wish. And you can decide any time to exercise your rights, answer any questions, or make any statements. Do you understand those rights? Yes. Yes? Okay. So you were just at the, at the jewelry store. Yes. Did you know the people that were robbing the place? No. I had no idea. You had no idea that was going on? No idea. And I what were you doing at the jewelry store? To look for a bracelet for my mom for Christmas. Okay. Did you buy a bracelet for your mom? No. I were didn't. you in the store when the robbery happened? Yes. I, I okay. Was and can you tell us what happened? I walked in and she was like, oh, how are you doing? This like, is the store person, the yes. store uh, employee. Yes. Okay. And I was like, oh, how are you? I'm doing good. And she said, are you looking for anything particular? And I said, I'm looking for um, some jewelry for my mom. More like a bracelet. And then people came. One came first. I have a I froze, I didn't know what to do. And then that, the other two came. And I don't know what to do. I dropped my bag. Did they take your bag? That's what I was asking her. My bag was in there. Okay, did you find your bag? I didn't. Okay. So you didn't know these guys at all? You were just there shopping for a bracelet for your mom? That's all that I wanted to do. Was get okay. But, you, but we don't know where your bag is at this point. I don't know. I'm asking you. 24 to 142. Can you see if this girl's bag is inside the store? Yeah, I don't know that necessarily we're getting the whole story just yet, but... You have bags in your trunk? Like what kind of bags? Like stuff to have, like my hair products, my makeup. Okay. Clothes. But like all legit stuff, nothing stolen, nothing crazy like oh. that? Negative. There's no person Do you here. mind if we pop in and look? Yeah. Is that okay with you? You have the, the, the keys. Okay. Well, keys are on the top of the thing there. So if this investigation goes and they end up arresting these three guys and they say that you were in there with them helping out, what would you say to that? You would say, absolutely not? Absolutely not. Okay. I'm just... The lady initially described you as a potential involved person. So that's why we're stopping you. That's why you're being contacted. And that's why we're trying to figure out if you are involved, if you were going in there distracting this person, or if it just happened to be that you showed up. Have you ever been arrested before? Never. Never? Never. Has this car ever been used in any kind of crimes? No. Never? No. Okay. So, this th is that the bag you're looking for? No. Okay, what's the kind of bag that you are looking for? It's uh, about this bag. What's in it? My money. How much money? About like four, five hundred, okay. like four fifty. Why do you have a glove on? Just one. I always just have one glove on. You always have one glove on? I do. Fair enough. No, well, oh. not always, but... Can I ask you why you don't put a glove on the other hand? Because I lost the other one. Okay. But I really like this material on my face. Okay. So, so All right. So there's nothing in the car that shouldn't be? Is there going to be any jewelry from that place inside the car? No. Do you mind if we look real quick? You do mind? No. I mean, okay. okay. Understand that you don't have to let us. It's voluntary. You understand that? Yeah. Okay. You have the right to stop the search at any time and limit the scope of the search. Do you understand that? Is that a yes? Yeah, yeah I understand. Okay. I'm just... Okay. I'm just traumatized. I get it. It's scary. Yeah. So do you mind if we look to make sure there's no jewelry? Um, you guys can. Okay. Is, it, is this the bag you're looking for? No. 
Okay. Twenty-four to one four two. Uh, if there's surveillance, does it show the guys ever talking to this female, or appears like they know each other? Or anything? It took the victim's phone, which has access to the video. She's attempting to log onto her computer now. Okay. Hey, who are these people? Mark. Mark. Eric. Uh, Kimberly. Yeah, that's my friend. Kimberly. Kimberly. Yeah. Okay. That's me. That's you. Who's Albert? I don't know that card. Who's uh, Valerie? Who are these people? So, the tide man. Here, can I, do me a favor real quick, okay? Yeah. You would do yourself a lot more justice if you'd be honest, okay? Most people don't have other people's Costco cards or other people's Visa debit cards or other Visa cards, other Visa cards. Oh. Kimberly is my Oh, she is? Yes. Okay. Is there any chance that Albert would say that, oh, it's okay if like she has my debit card? No. No, no. So you definitely shouldn't have that, should you? No. Do you think that that's going to so come out stolen? The clerk here is saying that she's possibly involved with him. She held the door using a glove and everything to kind of prevent oh. print transfer. <laughs> yeah. All right. Stand up real quick. We're going to put you in handcuffs. The reason you have a glove on, it sounds like, is maybe you didn't want to leave your okay. prints at the scene. But guess what? We'll figure it out, okay? But here's the deal. If you want any help from us, this is your opportunity to be honest, okay? So you need to think really hard right now about being straight up. Those guys, that if you were with them, guess what? They're not in handcuffs right now. You are. So guess who got guess who got the shitty end of the deal? Do you want to talk to us or not? I'm guessing you probably do. You let me know when this is sunk in enough to where you want to talk to us, okay? When you're ready to give us those guys three names, tell me, okay? I'll come talk to you. Fair enough? We have one page that didn't go out. Copy that one thing. You want, you want to tell me their names now? I really don't know them. Well, you you must know something about them. I don't. I swear. Give me some street names. I don't know them. So you tell them you had nothing to do with that. Is that really what you want to stick with? As this whole thing unfolds and it shows you more and more involved, I promise with my glove, I wear my glove like this all the time. Just the one glove? Just the one Okay, well what I'm going to do for right now is I'm going to go run these people's names and if they come back as victims, you're going to go to jail for possessing stolen property. Let me know when you're ready to talk to me. Hey, one of those numbers came back to a guy, so... What were the names she gave you? Ron and Stavo. Okay. Hey, is one of the guys... One of the guys that uh, you were with tonight named Lorenzo? I don't know any Lorenzo. What's that? I don't know any Lorenzo. Okay. Whose number is that in your phone? Stavo. Stavo? Describe him to me. Tall. What's that? Tall. Can you talk a little bit louder so I can hear you? Tall. Okay. White guy, black guy? Samoan. Okay. What kind of hair has he got? Long. Okay. Any tattoos or anything? Yeah, on his hands. On his hands? What kind of tattoos? Uh, I don't know what kind of tattoos, but it's full. He's got like sleeves? Or just covering the whole hand? Covering the whole hand. Okay, on both hands? I'm not sure, I know. Does he have a thin build or a, a thick build? Body? Yeah. Thicker. He's thicker? Like how much would you say he weighs? Maybe 200. Okay, and how much taller than me is he? Mm, Listen, maybe just a little this, this is your chance to be honest, okay? You want to try to help yourself, this is the time to do it. 
What? I know you do. But you made a bad choice tonight, right? How did you get mixed up with these guys? I got mixed up with them because they always have stuff to buy, clothes, and... Are you in a dating relationship with one of them? No. No? Do you get meth from them? How often do you smoke meth? I don't smoke. Look at me. I drink. What? I drink. You drink? Well, whose meth pipe is out in the car then? Hey, See? Smoke. Let's be honest. How often are you smoking meth? Mm, Just I every once in a while? Yeah? Do you get meth from one of these guys? Do you have any meth hidden on you? Hidden on me? Yeah. You got no. some in your bra? No. Be honest. I promise. Okay, where's your meth at? Uh, the only thing I have is that pipe. Just what's in the bubble? Alright. So, when these guys called you, did they tell you that they wanted to rob this place? No. No? When did you when did you find out they were gonna rob it? When they walked in, they set me up basically. You think they set you up? Yeah. How did they set you up? Because they, they, they told me about that store. They told me they knew I wanted to go look for a bracelet for me. Okay. They they told me to go there. So let me ask you this: If we were to look through your phone and look at all your text messages and all that stuff, would we find anything on your phone that has to do with this place getting robbed? Think about your answer now, because we have your cell phone, okay? And all we have to do is apply for a search warrant, and then we can look at all your text messages, we can look at social media, we can look at all the stuff that you've sent and received on your phone. So let me ask you this. If we look through your phone, are we going to find stuff about the robbery on your phone? Look at me. Are we going to find stuff on your phone? He did tell me when to go in. I can't hear you. He told me when to go in. He told me when to, he told you when to go in? Okay. So you did know that they were going to rob the place. Be honest now. I didn't know they were going to rob it. What did you think they were going to do? Here's the thing is, if you're not going to be honest with us, I'm going to stop talking to you. I'm going to shut the door and I'll just apply for a search warrant on your phone and I'll let that do the talking. Okay? So I'm going to ask you one more time to be straight up. Did you know they were going to rob the place? Yes or no? I had a feeling. You had a feeling they were going to rob the place. And did they tell you to open the door for them? They just said, now. They said, now? And then you opened the door so they could go in? Yes or no? I did. Huh? I did. I'm okay. Just... Yeah, you're scared, right? You made a bad choice. All right. Okay, so you are going to go today for Rob 2, okay? I'm going to go where? You're going to go down to Pierce County Jail for robbery in the second degree, okay? What? And we're going to take your phone for the search warrant. Okay? I can't go home. Is there any... You are not going to go home tonight, okay? There's no way I can go home tonight. No, ma'am. There's no way that you can go home tonight, okay? The best thing that I would advise you to do right now is continue to remain cooperative with every single person that you come in, come in contact with for the rest of the night, okay? I'm scared. you never been to jail before? No. Okay. So I'm going to give you some advice, right, that I would highly advise that you take, okay? If you act like you are acting right now and you are cooperative and you go with the program, it's going to go a lot better for you, okay? If you start to get feisty and you want to fuck around, well, it's not going to go well, okay? Well, there's no way I can go home if okay. I was I'm gonna able tell you to one get, more time. If I was able to get them. What's that? If I was able to, like, meet them. Meet them? For you guys. Where are they? I don't know, but if I went back on my phone, you know? I don't know. Talk to my sergeant. But we'll figure it out. She's, she's wondering if, she's like, what if I call them and try and get them to come back here? Not likely. Well, <laughs> I think it's awesome to think that they would, but I, I highly doubt this it. This is in airplane mode, so. Okay, so unfortunately that's not going to work. Right, we can't do that tonight. What's done is done. Okay, so you told my sergeant earlier 
that you had a feeling that this was gonna this was gonna go down. Did they? What happened earlier? At the movie theater. At the movie theater. Did they tell you that they were gonna rob this place? They didn't tell me they were gonna rob. What did they the say? To check it out. But then they told me to wait for them. They told me I told them to let me know when to go inside. They they told you that they were gonna let you know when to go inside. At what point did they tell you to put the glove on? No, I, this is really my glove. Okay. Why do you have it on? Just be legit. No. Normal I, people don't wear a glove on their left hand. Come on. I, I do. I drive with my left hand. It's weird. Right? That's kind of weird. Step out for a second. We gotta. Do you have any drugs on you? No. Okay, because that's a big time charge at the jail, right? If it's personal no. use, you're not going to get charged for it by us. But if it's more than personal use and they find it at the gym. Oh, it's like up to your nothing, nothing in your bra. Mm -hmm. Come on. Okay, have a seat. So we parked your car for you over there. Okay, your keys will go with you to jail. Uh do you they, they can't they're not gonna take this to jail, so you're gonna throw it away. Okay? Yes, no? Okay. Or do you want me to put it back in your car? Mm -hmm. The woman was taken into custody and charged with robbery. As the judge in this scenario, what would you sentence her to if she were found guilty? Feel free to share your comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos.